Yes. A warning as airports see another uptick in travel, people getting away for the holiday weekend and school vacation. Nick Giovanni is live at Logan with more on that. Nick? And Liam, pretty clear, talking to families over the last couple of days, a lot of them just want to get the kids out of the house for a few minutes, get them away for just a short time. So that said, school administrators, health officials, all stressing just one thing, that you approach this vacation time with caution. President of the Mass Teachers Association says educators are actually anxious about this week, namely because of the new COVID variants you just mentioned. Now, the head of the Department of Elementary and Secondary Education telling families whatever they can do to try and limit travel would be greatly appreciated. The concern stemming from spikes in cases seen after Thanksgiving and Christmas breaks prevented schools from being able to open up more robustly, as he put it. The health experts recommend only traveling with your immediate household to limit exposure to COVID-19 and wearing masks while you do so. The idea is really just do this as safely as possible. Mitigate the risk as much as possible. We're moving forward on our vaccination campaign, which is really important. That's where most of our focus should be. And we know a lot more about the virus now than we did before. So there are ways to socialize more safely. And if you are heading to Logan this morning, leaving Massachusetts, just keep in mind the state's travel orders still apply when you get back. And we know some schools are taking extra precautions on top of that. For example, Hanover Public Schools, the kids 11 and over will have to take a PCR test and then turn those results back to the school nurse before returning to the classroom. Live at Logan Airport, Nick Giovanni, WBD this morning.